welcome to our channel. This is Health Coach Team. Today, we are going to tell you about want to learn about acupuncture. Watch this. Before we start, please like and subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get new updates. Acupuncture is a procedure that many people have heard of, but do not know much about. Due to this lack of knowledge, folks are missing out on a truly wonderful thing. In the following piece, you are going to read acupuncture information that will help you see what it can do for you. If your acupuncturist says anything you don't understand, ask for clarification. The names of the meridians in the body may cause you to question what it all means. For example, your kidney meridian may have problems, but your kidney may be fine. Your practitioner can best explain what is going on. Do not assume that you will not be able to move once the needles are in place. A lot of people are afraid of acupuncture because they do not want to feel stuck once the needles are placed. Moving while the needles are in place is possible but it is best to stay still so you can relax. Don't be impatient for results. Most conditions won't be adequately treated until 30 appointments have passed. While you will not receive overnight results, you will receive long-lasting results once the treatments are underway. So have patience and await your new, better health. It will be worth it in the end. Do not hesitate to remove a needle if it makes you feel uncomfortable. Once your acupuncturist places the needle, you will be left alone for a while for the treatment to take effect. If you do not feel comfortable or if a needle is causing you pain, simply remove it. If it is your first time at a particular acupuncture office, take a moment to really look around. Is it a professional atmosphere? Is the office and procedure room clean? If you do not get a positive first impression, don't be afraid to walk out the door and try somewhere new. Before going to your acupuncture session, have a light snack. Do not overeat or go in with an empty stomach. This will help prevent dizziness or feeling nauseous. You want to be relaxed and comfortable. If you are hungry or bloated, you will not be relaxed and could hinder your treatment. Needles aren't the only thing that you may experience while receiving acupuncture. Depending on what's ailing you, you could also receive other treatment techniques, including mild suction via suction cups and light skin scraping. There may even be light massage involved. These are totally normal techniques, so feel confident in your practitioner. Even if you are a skeptic when it comes to acupuncture, do your best to keep an open mind. Scientific studies are ongoing regarding the effectiveness of such treatments. And there is new information being discovered all the time. Keep up to date on current research, discuss your findings with your doctor and consider acupuncture treatments for your health conditions. This just might help you to find the relief you have been looking for. In conclusion, acupuncture is not something many people are well educated about. 
However, with some research on the subject, people can see that it is something that can provide them with a lot of benefits. Put the tips above to good use and you will soon be able to use acupuncture to your advantage. So guys, I'm all today. This is just an informative video. Thanks for watching this video. If you like it, please share and subscribe.